Yo, what is up guys? It is Yellowfin and it is that time again. Two days in a row, it's time for another 500k pack opening. We've already got 100 cars wishlisted, looking good. Hopefully we can get this Plymouth XNR. That'll mean then I have every American Uncommon collected. There's a lot of other interesting wishlists as well, so hopefully we can get one this time. Because in the previous 500k, we got one Epic, which was a keeper but three ultra rares, all of which I already owned. So really, I would be perfectly content after we had great results in that last one with just one new ultra rare. One, ooh, we also have the Car Wow um, starter pack, so let's do this one. Very cool looking event, very excited for it. Hopefully they release some nice prize cars with it too. Suzuki Alto Works, another Suzuki Alto Works. Volkswagen Up, Volkswagen Polo, and, oh dang, a Mercedes. Okay, I already own all of those. So that's a little bit unfortunate, right? Let me just check and make sure. Yeah, I already own all those, so none of those will be that useful then, or probably kept. But we have got some ceramic packs to open. And we'll start off with that times five ceramic. And hopefully we won't get trolled as much as the previous five times where we went like 48 on like card num super rare number three. So out of like eight super rares. So hopefully we can have a bit better luck this time. Citroen DS4, we're just looking for that Plymouth. That's, I think, 28 RQ. So maybe we can get lucky. 27, 27 Mercury, 27 Infinity, Mazda 27, 28 Dodge. Come on, Plymouth. Nope, we went over the limit. Okay, we also can get the Mercury Montego, but no, we already went over that limit too. MG Montego, Chrysler 200, Ford Ranger, 40 with the DS7 Crossback. All right. 42 Aston Martin V8 Coupe. Let's get some jumps, maybe. Honda Accord Euro R. 43 Mini Cooper. 43 Mini Cooper again. This is not looking that promising. But here we go. Let's see. Maybe. Nope. 46 Civic Type R. That was very disappointing times five. Let's see, though. Do we get any new USA cars? We didn't. Yep. That is a very disappointing times five. So it looks like we'll just stick with the singles for these next 10. Hopefully have a bit better luck because we just we didn't even have any jumps in that times five there was no jumps at all so let's see dodge caravan got that one last time so don't need that one anymore citron bx a bart and oh yes let's go ford fpv gs ute wishlisted new ultra rare that is a great one very happy to see that one pulled from the pack that is one wishlisted car down very happy to have that now. Dang, that's that's perfect. That's literally what I wanted. Wishlisted Ultra Rare makes the pack opening. There we go. All right, let's 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 see if we can get another, maybe. We got nine more ceramics to go. So there are still some pretty good chances to at least get another Ultra Rare. Aston Martin DBS, TVR Timar, Peugeot 406, Oldsmobile Aurora. Nope, Abarth, or not Abarth, Fiat 124. Okay, nothing special from that one. Eight packs to go now. Peugeot. We need to see that Plymouth. Come on. Honda. Nope. Alpha and Infinity. All right. Nothing too exciting from that one. Come on. 28 RQ Plymouth XNR. That's what we want to see. 21. 28. Okay. 28 again. Not the right 28 though. Ooh, 46. That's a pretty high start. 320D Touring and... Let's go! Chevy Corvette Grand Sport. Already own one of those, so that'll probably be fuse material, I think. Because there's just a lot of better American epics, too. Like, there's the Viper. But Corvette Grand Sport, I've had this car for a very long time. 1,150 days. And to get a second one now, that is pretty interesting. It's not bad, though. That's the thing. 3.299. But I went to fully upgraded. Like, I do have the Corvette, too, which I can max out, and the Z06. That's 3.788. What are the specs on this? 3.889. Yeah, but lacking MRA. That is pretty cool, though. That is a cool pull. Probably will be a Fuse Epic, though. But still, I will definitely take an Epic right there from that pack. Not sure how many ceramic packs we got left now. I think it's seven. But the luck is pretty solid right now. That is very nice to see. Mazda Cosmo. Alfa Romeo 33, TVR, okay, Alfa Romeo, and 
and Mercury. I almost said MG. Mercury Mountaineer. Not special. Not too special, I mean. Because I already got one of those, so. It's not like a new American car. Renault Clio. Smart. Ooh, Ford Explorer. I believe I already have that, though. And I already have that Alfa Romeo, so. That one's not that special. Ooh, maybe we should go for a times five, though. Another times five. See if we can get some good luck. I'll do it after this pack. We'll be going over a little bit then. Over 500k. 41 and 44. All right. But let's give the times five another shot. The opportunity that it hopefully deserves. <coughs> Ooh. Now I'm choking on the word opportunity. <clears throat> 34. Not 34. I mean five. Trying to count and I can't even count properly. Six, seven, eight. Come on, show me some of the good stuff. 9, 10, 11, please show me the Plymouth. 12, 13, nope. 14, no. <laughs> we got that Chrysler again, though. This is 16, 17, 18, 19. Okay, 41 RQ, not bad. Let's see some jumps. 20, oh, and that's a good jump, too. 45, okay, 21. 47, not bad. Let's keep going. 22. Alfa Romeo Brera. All right, come on, jump, please. Oh, oh my, oh my God. That's 23. Oh, oh my goodness. That That's 23. There's two cards left in this pack. Fiat Abarth, 131, Mirafioro Evolution. 67 are cute, immortalized in carbon. There's two cards left in this pack. No way. All right, let's see, let's see. Jump. Oh, Nazca C2. Already got one of those, but still, that'll be fuse material, but a very nice car if you don't have one yet. We still got one more card in this pack. So let's see. Spinning it around in three, two, one. Oh, yes. Jaguar XJR 575. That is a crazy pack. What the heck was that? Two Fuse Epics right here, the Corvette Grand Sport and the Nazca C2. And then two Keepers, the Fiat Abarth with the Immortalized in Carbon tag from the 70s and the Jaguar XJR 575. Plus, we also got a wishlisted Ultra Rare 2, the Ford FPV GSU. Any new American cars? Oh, we got one. Oh, the Ford Explorer actually is a new one as well. What a pack opening, I do have to say. What an opening. Um, let's go to not owned and decide what we should keep and what not to keep. The Brera should probably be kept. Uh, Integra's cool, but I mean, I'm probably not going to go out of my way to max it right now. See, so yeah, all the rest of these, uh, I'll lock the Integra for now. And then all the rest of this stuff can just be added. These other few super rares. What a pack opening, though, I do have to say. That is crazy. Four epics from 500k, three of which came out of that times five. That times five was the best decision I could have made right there to open it. That jump, what was it, 47, I think, with the Alfa Romeo to 68? Like, that's crazy. But there we go. Dang, what a pack opening. And we'll have another 500k coming soon, so definitely subscribe. I don't know if I could have much better luck than that, though. That is actually insane. Three epics from a times five ceramic. Definitely made up for that all super air one. Okay, we're almost done selling all of these. Then we'll check how many fuse epics do I have now? I keep on pulling good fuse epics too. I've got 10. Yeah, like you see all these are like higher Q ones, but I already own one. And there just isn't really much of a need. Actually, I have two of this Lancer Evo. Two of that Evo is good. Caterham CSR just never gets that much use. The KDM Expo never gets any use. RLX, I already have two CT6s, so I don't really need a second RLX. French events just aren't that common. The Corvette, I just have better cars. Audi RS4, there's just better Audis. Already have this maxed and that maxed. And then the Maki, you don't really need two of. Then I've got some nice ultra rares too. And then a good amount of super rares. Actually, a very large amount of super rares. I should probably go back to working on my TVR Griffith 500. Pop a fuse into it. There we go. But wow. What a pack opening. We did get two new epics as well. 
to add to the collection. This one, the Fiat Abarth 131, which is actually pretty good looking. 4.587, that does not look too bad. And another great city streets car. I have the lower RQ Jaguar, the red one, and now I have the XJR 575 too. Both great city streets cars. Where is Jaguar? In here somewhere, Jag. There it is, yeah. I've got the XJR and now I have the XJR 575, so both are very good cars. Definitely happy to have that now. What a pack opening, I do have to say. That is crazy lucky. Plus, we also got the Ford FPV Ute, wherever that is, too. Somewhere right here. Yep, right there, the FPV GS Ute. Dang. Well, that is going to be it for this video. Join the Discord server, link in description. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. I'm Yellowfin, and goodbye.